Continuing our team coverage, News 2 investigator Rebecca Collette has been digging into the background of this alleged shooter, and she joins us now with what she found. Rebecca? Brendan, good evening. The alleged shooter we just found out from the coroner is 36-year-old Travis Smith. The coroner has confirmed that he died of a self-inflicted gunshot wound to his head. At that press conference today, the sheriff confirmed Smith had been in trouble with law enforcement before. He faced previous charges of forgery, obstruction of justice, and altering checks. But why this confrontation between the deputy and the suspect escalated has yet to be determined. As she was getting information on uh, Travis Smith, that's when the fight broke out and uh, obviously gunfire ensued uh, during the, the altercation with Deputy Gist. I've also been looking at the background of that officer. We know she was on patrol about a year. She had been promoted just last month, and before that, she was working at the detention center in Berkeley County. According to her LinkedIn page, she was previously employed as a cashier at Bilo. Rebecca Collette, News 2.